I'm working on a very elementary radio consisting of a field effect transistor here in the middle of the screen and an uh, audio stage with a detector, so not an audio stage but a uh, high frequency amplifier with a detector here. Um, it's all in the next video that I want to publish on YouTube and demonstrate now This is a religious religious radio station in the Netherlands and when we look at the way the radio signal is detected we see that here but it's more interesting I think to uh, show a shortwave coil a shortwave tank circuit so that we can receive in the shortwave range and that's the aim of this video I want to show here how to make the shortwave coil. This is the shortwave coil consisting of approximately 3, 10 or 11 windings on a toilet roll. The toilet roll is first covered with this type of glue, glue for sewage pipes inside and outside. I have fixed the windings a little bit with needles and um, after that I'm going to cover the windings completely with this type of glue. 11 windings, this is the diameter um, and generally spoken this is a good shortwave coil and then I mean an antenna coil. At the moment here I use this antenna coil connected to uh, this antenna, uh, one meter wire and perhaps it's interesting to show how selective such a circuit is. Um, have to put on the audio amplifier again. That's this. Well, this is the audio amplifier. And now I move the coil, sorry, the core in and out. And here you can see and hear how selective this works. So this is slug tuning. And uh, uh, Of course I can turn the here the, the the capacitor too, the tuning capacitor. When I do that here you can see that also the signal completely gets away, gets back when I tune in. And it all has to do with the properties from the antenna. When the antenna connected to the radio here is too long you will hear very very messy sound, much noise at the background and I've coupled this antenna on to the circuit with tiny capacitor from as far as I could see uh, 11 picofarad or so. That, mean, that means a very loosely coupled antenna and even with such a very loosely coupled antenna um, or just with such a very loosely coupled antenna, there is good selectivity. The fact that it is loosely coupled here and a high qual uh, quality coil here makes that it has good selectivity. So uh, I want to demonstrate in the next video how to receive shortwave uh, stations with this very very simple radio concept and um, I hope that will be interesting. Two transistor stages that um, make a direct uh, radio reception possible. 